So here are two mathematically similar shapes. This large picture and a smaller version of it. So we get the smaller one by reducing the size of the larger one. And the length reduces in the same proportion as the breadth reduces. That's what we mean by similar shapes. So the cost of each picture, we're told, is proportional to its area. Large picture costs £13.75. We have to find the cost of the small picture. Now, before we tackle this, let's have a wee look at uh, lengths and areas. Suppose we have a square of side 2 that has an area of 4. And let's do an enlargement of that so that we've got a side of 3. Now the area of the larger square is now 9. It used to be 4, it's now 9. The sides used to be 2, they're now 3. So there's an enlargement going on of length ratio 2 to 3, which gives an area ratio of 4 to 9. That's 2 squared to 3 squared. So if we have a length ratio, 2 on the small one, 3 on the large one, we can square each of these numbers to get the ratio of the areas, 4 on the small to 9 on the large. So in this case, this is one method we can use. I'll show you another method after this one. But in this case, if we're looking at the lengths, you can see that we've got 100 on the large one to 60 on the small one. Well, that's like 10 to 6. I've divided both by 10. Indeed, it's 5 to 3. You can divide both of these by 2. So we've got a length of 5 on the large one would correspond to a length of 3 on the small one. And if we're looking at areas, let's square both of these. We'd have 5 squared to 3 squared. That's 25 to 9. So 25 area on the large one, 9 area on the small one. Now the cost is proportional to the area. So we could turn this into costs. If the large one costs £25, then the small one would cost £9. If the large one cost £1, that would be a 25th. We would divide by 25. But it actually costs £13.75. So multiply both of these numbers now by 13.75. We'll get 9 over 25 times 13.75.75. So that should be the cost. Let's try it in the calculator, see what goes on. So 9 divided by 25 times 13.75 gives us £4.95. So the smaller picture would have to cost £4.95. So that's one method of doing it, just with these uh, ratios. Now another method is to do scale factors. The length scale factor now this is from large to small would be, because it's a reduction, small number over large number, 60 over 100, which would be 6 tenths, 3 fifths. And therefore the area scale factor, that's a reduction scale factor from the large to the small, would be that squared. Therefore, the cost of smaller picture would 
would be equal to 13 pounds 75 times that scale factor. And if we have a look at that, um, 13 point 75 times 3 fifths squared and again we get 4.95 as we did previously so there's two different methods of finding the cost of the small picture